Hi guys, welcome to Origin. Uh, it's another crap lighting video again, but I don't want to forget and I don't know when I'm gonna next be able to film, so... I just want to point out more music idiocy. This time with... Mott the Hoople and all the young dudes. Now... There's a comment there by me, but... Where is it? Yes, here we go. Green Day ripped off the sound for 21 guns. Really, consider that what would be called popular music has been around for 60 years. Consider that untold billions of songs must have been written in that time frame and then tell me with a straight face that no two of those songs could have slight similarities and to show you how slight the similarities are in this case I'm going to play both of those songs on the keyboard right now well just the first half of the chorus of each song because that's where the similarities are As you could hear, the rhythmic structure of the melodies were very similar, but the notes were completely different. The chords were the chords were quite similar, but again, there were clear differences there. So what do you think? Rip off or not rip off? And before you make up your mind fully, let me just show you two more things. I'm going to link you to the video for What the Hoople, the one I'm on right now, and I want you to listen to the very beginning and then tell me if that's a rip-off of the Packle Bell Cannon. And then, since we're on the topic of Green Day as well, I want you to listen to the song Basket Case, which I'll also link in the description, and tell me if that's a rip-off of the Packle Bell Cannon. The first four chords of All the Young Dudes sound very similar to the first four chords of the Packle Bell Cannon. And Basket Case uses exactly the same chord structure as the Packle Bell Cannon with one difference at the end and it's transposed up to E flat instead. Here's the Packle Bell Cannon. Etc. Etc. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.